So I've been part of the ECA since as long as I can remember. So my parents used to show um, Murray Gray cattle when I was a little kid, so I started going then. Uh, then at high school, I started to uh, tag along with my dad who used to help with the uh, young judges competitions. And from there, I've just continued on that journey. It's always been something that I've sort of driven myself as an opportunity to continue to meet people uh, and get involved with really great organisation. So I think the big thing we need to remember is you don't know what you enjoy until you're given the opportunity to do it. Being involved with organisations like the ECA give you that opportunity. So one of the big things that I'm a part of there is the Young Judges competition, which works across 15 facets of the show. So I'm talking things like meat sheep, dairy cattle, cake decorating, uh, fish, uh, fine arts, photography, sculpture, fleece, everything that you can think of that is involved in a show, the RNA or the ECA gives you the opportunity to go and participate in that as an individual. By doing that, you may actually find something that you like. You may never know that you may really have a passion for, for understanding how, how fish work and what makes a great fish a great fish, or what makes a, a great fish display something better than anything else. By going, to, by going to your local show and participating in a competition that you may not have previously, you may fire something within you which actually drives an opportunity to do a career that takes you anywhere in the world. So one of the big parts that I really like to talk about is that a show is not only Sideshow Alley or a show is not only the night program every single day. What an agricultural show does is it drives development and competition within each specific industry. So what that means is that when you sit down at a restaurant in Sydney or sit down at a, a cafe in Melbourne, the produce that you're eating is then the best because it has had to compete as part of a, a national competition to get where it needs to go. So if we look at that cafe in Melbourne, I'm talking about the bread. What goes into the bread? That's the grains. At every of your royal shows around the country, there will be a grain competition to find better quality and drive better quality grains. If you go to your restaurant in Sydney, we're talking about the steak. Once again, that's our farmers improving their production to ensure that the steak that you eat at that restaurant is the best quality it can possibly be.